Bye Bye Power Gaming PC sounds like it's about to blow up, as the middle fan up front sounds like it has a bad fan bearing causing it to grind. I spoke with the customer and we decided to go ahead and replace the fan. And unfortunately, I Buy Power doesn't use standardized RGB fans, so the customer said just go ahead and replace all the fans with some higher quality fans, so let's go ahead and replace all of these with some P12 Max fans from Arctic. To do this, we first need to go ahead and pull off the rear panel and undo the poor cable management job, which is just one thing that always sucks about these cheap cases. One other weird choice about this build was for some reason the RGB fan hub requires two fan headers. So for some reason, I buy power thought it would be a good idea to use a one to three fan extension, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense until you realize how cheap of a motherboard they used, as there's only two fan header connectors on this actual board. Anyways, after pulling out the proprietary cables, I was able to go ahead and pop off the front of the case and unscrew or remove all three fans up front, followed by the one in the rear. Then from there, we can go ahead and fish through our cables and install our three fans up front, followed by the one in the rear. Once those are all in, we now have a much cooler and quieter PC that we 